Fishes only live in the oceans and sea. I think it's ecosystems. What is ecosystem? An ecosystem is made up of all the living and non-living things in an area. This includes all of the plants, animals, and other things that make up the communities of life in an area. An ecosystem also includes non-living materials. For example, water, rocks, soil, and sand, a swamp, a prairie, an ocean, and a forest are examples of ecosystems. Ecosystems are about animals and their environment. Hello guys! I heard you talking about ecosystems. Yes, yes Miss B. Miss B. And, and we, we want, want to know, know more about, about it. it. An ecosystem is a community of plants and animals, depending on each other in a given area. A habitat is the environment in which animals or humans live. In other words, a habitat is a place where living things live. There are three places where living things live. These places are on the land, in the air, and water. An example of an ecosystem is this pond. Yes, you are right. The pond is the habitat of the fish. Algae and the other things you see in there. Algae are non-flowering plants that only lives in water. Fishes eat them and other small fishes to survive. Frogs also eat fish to survive in water. Frogs can also survive on land by eating insects worms, and other animals. All the other animals that live in water depend on each other. That means the house in which Smart and I live, our home, is our habitat. It's a huge bird! It has a beautiful color. Birds live on trees, in the air. Humans, plants, and animals choose their habitat for many different reasons. Depending on their needs, one of the reasons is the way they can adapt to the environment. Please, Miss B, what does adopt mean? Adaptation is the way human, a plant, or an animal is designed to help it survive or live in its environment. Humans, plants, or animals depend on their physical features to obtain food, stay safe, and build their homes. These features make it possible for an animal to live in a particular place and in a particular way. An example is a fish, such as tilapia. It has fins and gills 
to help it swim in a pond. Birds and insects have wings, which help them to fly in search of food. The fin and the wing are the physical features of these animals that has made it possible for them to live in the environment that is in water and trees. Miss B, how do frogs survive in ponds? When frogs are babies, they look like fish. They are called tadpoles. Tadpoles have gills, which helps them hold their breath underwater for long and tails that help them paddle or swim in the water. When they grow into big frogs, they get lungs for breathing in and out of water and webbed feet which helps them to swim in water and hop on land. Fish, unlike frogs, have gills which are only for breathing inside water. They can therefore not survive on land because they don't have lungs. Smarty and Smart, can you tell me where chicken lives? Chicken lives in a chicken coop and it's on land. Great! Hope you can list where parrots, whale, and tiger lives. Parrots lives on tree. Whale lives in water. Tiger lives in the forest. Today, we learnt about ecosystems. Some animals eat plants and other animals for survival. Animals like fish, insects, birds, and frog have some features which help them adapt to the environment. <laughs>